So welcome to the question and answer session with Dr. Chaco and featuring myself, Vinny. So the first question we're going to ask here is, Dr. Chaco, can you please tell me the difference between skin testing and blood work? All right, that's actually a good question. I'm going to talk to you because I'm going to talk to these guys, but it's easier for me to talk right, to okay. you. Um, people always ask me, what's a better test? Um, um, as you, um, should it be a scratch test or a blood test? And it kind of depends on what we're looking at. Um, for example, if we're looking at environmental allergies, usually the scratch test is probably better. Mm -hmm. um, but sometimes, for example, we're looking at redness, for redness to pop up. So in skin like yours and eyes and mine, mm -hmm. the redness won't pop up as much. Gotcha. So in lighter skin, so it'll be good, but in darker skin, it might not come up as much. So I might double check that with blood work. Mm -hmm. um, also, when we're talking about food allergies and you do those scratches and in a kid, you might not get a good dig and or the food allergies, they give you a quantitative measure. They give me a number like your IgE to peanut is two or it's five or it's 10. And based on those numbers, I know the probability of if you were to eat it, the probability of you having a reaction. So the long answer is it depends on the case. Most of the time for environmental allergy testing, the, envi the scratch is better. Uh, with food allergies in particular, when we're talking about anaphylaxis or maybe with kids, I'd like to follow that up with blood work because you never want to miss anything. So both, it just depends on the case, but both give you uh, important information.